With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, we are given with a question and the question says that in ancient time, different system of units was following followed in which unit of mass was said. This was for mass. Length was good. G A Z. G A J. Unit of time was scale. One cell is equal to 900 gram. One gauge is equal to 90 centimeter. One cal is equal to 3 hours. A ball of mass 9 kg is moving with velocity 10 meter per second. Then its momentum in ancient system will be how much? So since we know that momentum is equal to mass into velocity, right? So momentum is equal to mv simply, which is equal to 9 kg into 10 meter per second. So it would be equal to, p would be equal to 90 kg meter per second, right? So 1 kg is equal to, so this is 90 kg meter per second. Now kg is equal to, 1 kg is equal uh, equal to 1000 grams, right? And 1 se is equal to 900 grams. So therefore, we can write that 1 kg is equal to 10 by 9 se, right? This is the value. Now, since 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter, right? And one for length, it is given as uh, it is one gauge is equal to 90 centimeter. 90 centimeter, right? So again, we can write here that one me, uh, meter is equal to 10 by 9. gauge right similarly for the value that is one cal is equal to 3r so since we were having 3 hours is equal to one cal right k double e l so from here what we could say is that one sec so this would be 3 into 3600 hours that would be equal to 1 kel. So 1, uh, sorry, not R here, it is seconds. So 1 second is equal to 1 by 3 into 3600 kel. Right? So the momentum here. Therefore, we can write that momentum is equal to 90 kg meter per second would be equal to 90 into 1 kg is equal to 10 by 9 cell. So it would be 10 by 9 into 1 meter is equal to 10 by 9 gauge whole divided by 1 by 3 into 3600. So this would turn out to be equal to 90 into 100 into 3 into 3600 whole divided by 9 into 9. So this cancels this. So this is 10 now. This ones are, this threes are. And this is 1200. Right? So this becomes 1.2 10 to power 3 into 10 to power 6. The unit would be cell gauge per cal. So 1.2 into 10 to power 6 cell gauge cal inverse. So option C is the correct answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.